and yet two teams from very different league that is simply not good enough when you have those two on your roster absolutely under pressure of course uh, in terms of foreign players there's still Lucas Podolski there but he hasn't played uh, since May meanwhile for Barcelona they've made five changes from that game against Chelsea as expected yeah Ricky Puch most likely is going to be a little bit more central of course he's going to be the one uh, playmaker that Collado towards the left as well uh, Griezmann leading the attack Rafinha of course against Chelsea was the false nine via Iniesta and Samper, maybe a little lesser known, but a Barca guy too. Yeah, I suppose uh, if you look at David Villa, he'll probably play through the middle. Goke may be on the left-hand side with Ogawa on the right-hand side, but all eyes really on Iniesta and David Villa. Season against Liverpool, 3-0 at home, 4-0 away. Liverpool, the champions of Europe. The likes of Ricky Pucci in the second half. I think we'll see Carlos Alenia, another player in the midfield. But I think it's going to be Atsua. For mounting a bit from Barcelona. It's been a little sloppy from you know in that match uh, Just got thrown into the lineup, but did what Christian Pulisic uh, does in uh, for Barcelona though from Atletico Madrid All crossed All taken away Iniesta Iniesta nearly turned back the clock the visa Kobe this would be a little strange playing against uh, Barcelona. Juden Copa del Rey. Oh, ball brought down nicely. Chance now for Barcelona is pulled wide. Oh, what an opportunity for Ricky Puch. He feel that he's got to put that away. Here's that high pressure. That's well done. And lofts it forward. That'll drop right in. Ogawa. That's simple enough. Slide in. Play already. All lofted over the back line, and that header skips along from Dunkler. Ogawa. Overrun for the ball. But not for the near future. Griezmann slips it ahead. Semedo on that cutback. Griezmann, the return, and it's hammered by Rafinha. Semedo. Water over the top. The ball driven back across. Akitic really trying to show well in this preseason, maintain his role. He uh, barrel rolls through that challenge. Yeah, at that time, uh, Antoine Griezmann looked like he was confused where to go because uh, Rakitic came where to go because uh, Rakitic came out of that pretty well. I didn't think he was going to be in possession of that ball, and Griezmann, rather than going the other way, came towards him. So uh, Rakitic here had no options, really. Well, kind of. I think this rumor <laughs> has uh, a lot of legs. Uh, Rafinha, those are all central midfielders uh, right now. They're looking to make the game rather than finish the game. Not everybody uh, verbalizes it. Collado. Collado goes down. Rafinha trying to turn through it. SL. One wing can make a, yeah. a difference. This ball was uh, pushed in toward Rip. Made that challenge. Ball falls kindly here. Chance to shoot. Maya's there again to deny Rakitic. Pisha, Hernandez going to Barcelona. Diego Godin. Busquets trying to find Griezmann. Griezmann's frustration is uh, evident. Well, here's that build up, and Busquets just trying to clip that over to Antoine Griezmann. Here's where. You look at the, the run they made in Champions League. I mean, it was one of the most awe-inspiring stories. Next era, of this era and the next era. Uh, for me, absolutely ready to play. Start for Barcelona in any game. How much time does he get when you look at that midfield right now? And uh, young Frankie de Jong in there as well. With all the greats that have played for Barcelona. Oof. Oof. That is... Uh... Enough to cut the grass, but didn't ultimately get that into the net. Yeah, even Rakitic. The Spanish national team. No stranger Oof. to the big game. Shouldn't be. Iniesta swings it out wide. Fujitani. On goal. Iniesta. Just little things that they still do. There they are combining again. Slid away from Villa after. From Villa. And Iniesta 
Flag is down now. And for Stegen. First up. That's lifted to and Barcelona go the other way. Just continuing to fight through this and eventually falling down. Clayano got everybody out of sorts. Yamaguchi got everybody out of sorts. Yamaguchi just trying to hang on for dear life. Well, you liked him early, and I tell you what, he's having a pretty decent game. Oh. A backup with some serious potential. Rakitic off the wall. Started in Barcelona, made their way over to Japan. Cut back, Griezmann. Lost that over. In pursuit of his first goal in Barcelona colors. Yeah, not a, comf a comfortable strike right there as he comes to the near post. Uh, for uh, Barcelona here. Griezmann on the cutback toward the penalty spot. Iniesta did well to play Agawa. Agawa cutting back. Iniesta. This ball hammered on the line and saved by Makawa. Hakitic involved again. You want to talk about a guy who's playing with his Griezmann. He's taking off the ball. Semedo. Good ball. Maybe one more chance. <laughs> Iniesta combining. Lofted it over this back. And for the first time. Attack on for Cuellado. Is this an international friendly? I did. To drive this cross, it rings off the post. Came in, uh, played against Chelsea as well. This ball uh, lobbed over the back line. Target. Maybe a chance to break through here. Dembele and Villa were probably the most insightful combination between the two teams for Barcelona. We thought there would be big changes. There have been. Neto moves into goal. Esther Stegen falls toward Dembele. Dembele! Just does bounce that inches wide of the pole table today. Lobbed upfield. How much doing there for Tanaka? Dembele for De Jong here. Tried to back heel it through. The only time he misses passes is when he's trying to do the spectacular. Oh. And now a foul at the edge of the penalty area. Played ahead here. Chance! Played ahead here. Chance! Five hole. Easy for Perez. He's got his first first team goal for Barcelona. And the 21 year old breaks the deadlock in the 59th. Carlos Perez starts this move right there. Good understanding uh, from Malcolm. Look at this. He wants the ball and he gets it. And uh, he almost forces Malcolm to play that ball. So a wonderful uh, play from Perez. I thought he looked decent uh, uh, for about 15, 20 minutes against Chelsea here. As he loves sitting deep, just like Busquets in front of the uh, in front of back four. But he can also play ahead of Busquets. Allow the Dembélé's maybe Malcolm if he's there. Ball slipped ahead, Tanaka. For as long as he finds himself in the squad and with some minutes, he'll be happy enough. Driven ball, snapped previously. Yeah. It's Alenia. Nearly any other club in, in, in the world. Well, yeah, but I mean, it's easy to say before the season that they're here. Uh, excellent touch around. Ultimately, it did break down. It'll be a chance to get up here, Masayama. Deflected ball came back. It's hammered off target. As you see in the end, uh, Yasui. Excellent from Jaime here. Malcolm hammers that off the top of the superstar cherry on top. Look, he, he had a really good partner. Disappointed me so far. In the, in the first half, it was Ricky Pooch. Ricky Pooch. Perez! Oh, that's an excellent finish. Make it two for Carlis Perez. For Carlis Perez, Barcelona seemingly puts a bow on this one in Japan.
Well, he's just taken over from Malcolm as the player of the second half. Uh, uh, Perez very much involved. That first goal was absolutely outstanding. The way he kind of created for himself in terms of there's a bit of a shield going to the far post. Uh, uh, perfectly struck ball right there. You can see the goalkeeper way out of position.